Hey kids, is it clear? Let's play Golden Sun. Down Golden Sun, Earth Lizards. I dislike the Earth Lizards. Okay, how do we fight you guys? I'll tell you how we fight you guys. Angel Spear. One of the new moves they have. And I'm pretty sure these guys do in fact use Synergy, so... You'll want to do what you can to stop them. You'll notice in these crossbow aisle fights, I always focus my attacks on one of the enemies. That's because it's a good idea. Oh man, I just realized Mia's not a medium, so I can't try cursing them to death. Also, Mother Gaia. Yeah, the Earth Lizards are pretty tough. Fortunately, we are tougher. Alright, you revive him, and you heal us all. And that's how revive works. Easy. Now, I'm gonna steal that guy's sandwich too. He is annoying me. us, you seal that guy's synergy, you use wish, and you cutting edge. Protector! Now these guys are tough, but fortunately they can be hit with status effects pretty easily. I mean, my recent failure might lead you to believe otherwise, but don't believe my lies. Oh, and they can heal themselves. Did I mention that? Well, now you know. Don't you feel happy? Knowing that I've helped you to slay Earth Lizards. Because you should be happy. Now you heal Garrett more, because I don't think a single wish is going to tide him over. There we go. Acid Blessing. Stop with the healing. Okay, some more defense. And bind his synergy. You use wish, and you cutting edge that guy. Yeah, I'm taking more strategic approaches here, it looks like. Which sadly does not mean as much crush, kill, stab, crush. But oh well. You make some sacrifices to do stuff. Add some soda, man. You have soda? Because I have soda. Alright, you protector. You bind that guy now. Because anything we can do to limit their ability to kill us is a good thing. Alright, both of their synergies are sealed. No more Mother Gaia from you. I don't think they have much in the way of synergy, and they can still attack just fine, but hey. Alright. No, don't do the Jin commands. See, this is what I like. You can use status effects on enemies that are major in this game. Even the instant kill ones that aren't really... No, some of them are instant kill, but we don't have them yet. Oh, hey, you can use Clay Spire. I didn't know that. For your insolence, you get death. Mia and Isaac do physical attacks, because your attack got buffed. I forgot that. Also, Ivan is faster than Garrett now. I should do something to reflect this. I forgot. Forgive my forgetfulness. Well, that's annoying. You have, you do. Water of life. No one else has healing. And you ward Isaac, who will heal himself. Man, I can't wait until I get a multi-target resistance boosting synergy, because that is what I need. Man, that's a hell of a seal there, Ivan. Do that. 
No, wait, better idea. Do that. And you heal us. Dull. Nuts. Unfortunately, while status effects are generally pretty useful in fights, status lowering things like uh, break or dull or whatever. No, break is actually really good. But we don't have break yet. Dull, on the other hand, not so good. Yeah, big flaw with the samurai class, very, very few synergy points. So if you want to cast a whole bunch of buffs, then too bad. You're going to just have to have a wide selection, but very little, you know, ability to use it. Which is why it's such a good class for Garrett. He wards her again. I don't remember how many times she's been warded. And you wish again. There we go. There's a nice attack drop. And yeah, with multi-target and single target buffs, the single target ones are generally the stronger of the two, but on your team, multi-target ones are infinitely more valuable. On enemies, single target ones are generally the way to go. Start healing yourself, are you? You are a nefarious villain. Nefarious villains don't get to use magic. Only the protagonists and their hope and joy and tears of the children will be able to use magic. It's synergy, but you know, who says we have to make sense? We're playing video games. And Ivan is quite damaged. That's not a big deal. Boom! Acid bath! Sonic smash! That thing! That thing! And screw it, everyone just attack. Creativity is so three minutes ago. Hail Prism, nice. Wish well, very nice. Now we're cooking with napalm. Alright. Here's the area where you need carry. I don't think you can get, actually get everything in this area in a single run, so... stop. Yeah, we can go there and get that, or we could go... Meh, I'll just get whatever I can the first run, open it up, and go back, and stuff, stuff, stuff. You, this is the guy with carry. Right, now I can go there, get this. A lucky medal! I'm actually gonna not use any of the rest of those during this game. So you can carry your stuff over to the second game. Kinda like the Quest for Glory games. You remember those? Those are good games. Should find a remake of those sometime. Anyway, we're going this way with this thing. We could push it off the ledges, but that'd be counterintuitive. Alright. Garrett, use carry. And do it right. That's not doing it right. Alright, and now we can go back and forth between the entrance and the exit as we please. Oh, let's get this too. Yeah, they're trying to trick you with graphical funny bits. I'm very wordy today, aren't I? Let's go this way. That's not what the door sounds like. Now we'll need to get that and that. How do we get those? It's a secret to everyone. Except for me, because it's not. 
Anyway, I'm clear. Let's spend. Let's play Golden Sun. Next time, we're gonna get those last two treasure chests and hopefully complete cross Crossbone Isle. Though we'll probably just end up fighting monsters and having to do a couple more videos. But you know, whatever. It's all good. It's all stuff. It's all marmalade and I don't know, man. I just work here.